All right, y'all, man. I'm about to take y'all in my time machine with me and my hookah. I'm in here playing one of one of my favorite games of all time as a kid, Road Rash for the Sega Genesis. I am a beast at this game. Well, I was a beast at this game, but I was so good that they added me to the title screen. I'm the dude in the black motorcycle about to snatch a motherfucker up like, come here, bitch. Anyway, man, we're going to go ahead and hop into this. Now, if you guys ever played a motorcycle game called Hang On or Super Hang On, I played it for the, the Sega Master System. Uh, this game is very similar, but this game added the brawling aspect. So you can give no fucks in this game, none at all. And I live in the state of California. These dudes out here cannot drive. So. If you put a camera in my car, man, you're going to see me saying some crazy stuff, yo. Like, these dudes <laughs> uh, aggravate me to no end out here. But in this game, if a dude cut me off, I could just knock his ass off the bike. Simple enough. So, we're going to jump into this. I'm going to go to Sierra Nevada because I like that beer. Let me see if I can grab onto this. It's a great day to face a challenge onto the open road. Best luck. Oh, Biff. Motherfucker got a unibrow. <sighs> All right, so let me see if I can't remember how to. Okay, so B is go. Oh, here we go. C is the punch. B is to actually accelerate. Man, what the fuck am I facing? The the Golden State Warriors. Everybody rocking all blue, white, and yellow. Shit. Um, I believe this game was made for the the Sega Master System first, and it came up for the Sega Genesis. Um, but like I said, it plays a lot like Hang On. You can get fucked up in this game, man. Yo, if you and you can damn near ramp off anything. You can if a, if a dude crash his bike and he's running in the street, shit, you can ramp off this dude. But you can see, man, you can man get the fuck off me. You can knock a motherfucker out, man. And what I thought was cool, man, on Second Genesis, they got like the. The rear view left and right mirrors so you can see actually who's behind you. It's pretty good. Get off me, bitch. So like I said, they added the brawling aspect of the game. Punch, kick. And if somebody has a weapon, you can snatch the weapon from him and beat his ass with it. Oh, and they also got vehicles in this game. But let me tell you something. You get hit by a vehicle in this game, that shit is going to fling you at least a hundred yards and then you're going to slide another 50 on top of that this shit is out of control man but man i cut this game on man cut me off in real life i can't do nothing man but on this game cut me off man i will beat your ass as you can see man i'm just running through these dudes like it ain't shit man um until you actually reach uh, the player that is in first or second place, man, they're kind of hard to actually fight with you. There's also cops in this game. So, and I love fighting the cops, man. Who don't like fighting the cops, yo? Busting a motherfucking pig in the head. But you can also take his weapons too, man. The Billy Club. I can't remember exactly what weapons that you do have on this game. Um, but I, I remember there's, like I said, the Billy Club. There's Nunchuck. Uh, I think there's like a, a like a chain whip in this game too. Also, man, it's been a while since I played this game. But like I said, um, there's some stages in the game where you can get some crazy air just because of how the road is laid out. And uh, there's also sometimes ramps on the side of the road. I can't remember if it was in this one or the or the second one. But as you can see, ain't nobody around me, man. I'm just burning motherfuckers up on some Fast and the Furious shit. Almost got hit by a car. But like I said, I'm gonna start bringing this, this, these retro games to my channel. Um, love doing sports games, but retro games are definitely capturing my heart. As you can see, I have won. I think I might have been in first place. Give me my money. We all chilling in the woods and shit, cooking out. I don't know why they want to chill with me after I just punch half of them in the face. But as you can see, we, I just ran up against the Golden State Warriors. Don't know why they out there on these bikes. So I got first on that track. We can go to this next track, man. Damn, girl, you kind of fine, though. Red hair? Who don't like no red bone? We're going to 
gonna start this race. So Golden State Warriors again, man. I start off. I don't even care, man. And dude's got some crazy ass names. Rude boy. Fuck is grub. It just be random shit. Dude be named Nipple or something. Gunther. Everybody named fucking Gunther too. Come on, bro. But I'm trying to just run through. Once you get you a little weapon. Man, you be good to go. You be knocking people off the bike like it ain't shit. But what's funny about this shit, man. Once you get thrown, you get hit by a car or a sign or something like that. You got to run back to... Oh! See, see what I mean? This shit, how you slide that damn far? But the camera be fucked up. Because you can only see what's in front of you. So when you get knocked off your bike... You got to run and find your shit. And that shit can be anywhere. You can't really see what's behind you. So you just running. Hoping, hope, hope, hoping that you see it on the screen. But I feel like once you get knocked off one time. It's pretty much a wrap man. Unless you got a, a, a pretty quick bite. But with this standard bike. Uh, oh shit. Bitch get the fuck up off me. Some of these dudes you'll knock out or you'll punch. And then they'll pop back on the screen. Trying to knock your ass out. But this game, man, they got a Road Rash 2. I think the, the last Road Rash game they made was on PlayStation. And that was called Road Rash Jailbreak. Okay, we got some popo up here. Oh! I'm going to tell you like this, man. If you get if you get caught off your bike and a, a cop catch you, man, you bust it. Just like Grand Theft Auto, man, you bust it. This motherfucker waited for me. That's why I got, some, I got these hands for you, though. Come get these hands. Little dude right behind me. But if you get caught off your bike, man, that's a wrap, bro. You can kiss your shit goodbye. But every time you win a race, you get money. Uh, money can buy you upgrades for your bike. I, I'm not sure if they was if it was implemented for this game. I know you can buy new bikes, but I'm not sure if you can actually upgrade like parts and stuff to your bike. But yo, this game is is fairly cheap. If you ain't got a Sega Genesis. Man, you can go get this on an emulator. This game is fun as hell, bitch. I ain't really got the ramp off nobody yet. We used to play this shit with my brother. He be getting mad as hell when I'm punching him in the face. I think they only put the two player on the Road Rash 2. But they made a lot of Road Rash games, man. I I'm not sure why it fell off or, you know, I guess it just didn't, it just lost its appeal. We're trying to get first, which is probably not going to happen. And also down there where my speedometer is and my mirrors, you also. Oh, damn. I definitely didn't get first with this one. You have your bike health, too. So if you crash enough times, you pretty much going to total your bike. I'm going to keep playing this shit off in my time machine. If you played Road Rash before, man, comment, man. Yo, we, t we on this nostalgia kick, man. We trying to bring back memories. If you like the game, if you played the game before, man, let's talk about it down in the comment section. Like the video. Like I said, it's a very fun game. If not, man, like I said, pick it up. Install the game on the emulator. Yo, try it out, man. Knock some motherfuckers out. For some reason, we keep on playing these Golden State Warriors. I know they champions and shit, but damn, yo. Like, they put them on roll ass, too. Get the fuck off me. Motherfucker, punch me in my face. But it's your boy Resolve 1 o'clock, man. I got mine. What's yours?